you just think it's just another hotel, but it really isn't because it's one of the last hotels that's still standing here. You know, the Dunes is down. Uh, all these hotels are down. The Hacienda, the Dunes, the Sands, the Desert Inn. They're all gone. They're all gone. So uh, we're still standing. The El Cortez really exudes a sense of authenticity because not only are we, you know, really a historic property. We really truly have been here since 1941. We really truly have operated continuously ever since the day that it opened. Um, but we really bring that sense, I think, through the people that work here and the people that visit here. Whether they're from out of town and they come here regularly, uh, or they're the locals and we see them several times, it's a social club. Here, people come together at the El Cortez. They enjoy seeing each other. It's so much different. Sometimes in a larger property, you're lost. It's almost like you're being herded like cattle. Uh, you're a number. Uh, here, we know the people. We have a lot of old timers, whether they be customers or employees, um, or my dad. They're old timers. They really kind of operate in a sense of how Las Vegas used to operate. And we kind of retain also the original sense of value. And we really appreciate customers coming in and we want to give them a great bargain, a great value for what they're spending and be able to enjoy themselves over whatever time they choose to spend at the El Cortez. To sum up El Cortez in one word would be authenticity. Um, and that comes from a family that owns it, a family that operates it, and a group of employees that are just like that family. We're like an extension of that family. The way that the staff interacts with each other at the craps table, the dealers and the, the pit bosses, you know, the, the way that they kind of shoot the shit and rib each other and, and, and then you're in on the joke and everybody then starts talking, right? Like that's why you gamble at a table in Vegas. You gamble at a table to create a moment that you can remember. The money's gonna go, the money's gonna come, but the things that you sit around at the next table and talk about were those fun moments at the last table. And you get more of those here. They, they do a really good job of, of setting the conditions to create memories in a way that's authentic, that isn't trying too hard, that seems easy and silly and fun. Someone's winning right now.